Hello friends, I'm glad to be with you for uh, another week in prayers. Today, on this windy morning, I'm going to start with a prayer for the researchers and the scientists. Let's pray together. God, we come in prayer this morning and call you friend. Sometimes we find ourselves asking, why God don't you just make things better? We know, however, that you will end the virus, but that it will be with the hands and the minds of the scientists, along with the doctors and other healthcare professionals, and through the actions of the rest of us following the science. We are grateful for the progress made in the development of vaccines and the additional progress right around the corner. Help us find the peace of knowing that part of the story. Remind us to trust and be assured of the message that it will be all right, because we know that it will. Amen. Friends, our reading for today is from the book of Psalms, from Psalm 145, verses 1 through 10. I will extol you, my God and King, and bless your name forever and ever. Every day I will bless you and praise your name forever and ever. Great is the Lord, and greatly to be praised, his greatness is unsearchable. One generation shall laud your works to another, and shall declare your mighty acts. On the glorious splendor of your majesty and on the wondrous works, I will meditate. The might of your awesome deeds shall be proclaimed, and I will declare your greatness. They shall celebrate the fame of your abundant goodness, and shall sing aloud of your righteousness. The Lord is gracious and merciful, slow to anger and abounding in steadfast love. The Lord is good to all, and his compassion is over all that he has made. All your works shall give thanks to you, O Lord and all your faithful shall bless you. Friends, this is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Have a blessed day.